What's going on, you fam? Ryu in here. So the last unit that I had the fortune of pulling on the banner was this extreme Android 13 unit here. Uh, I'm kind of surprised that they made a extreme variant of this dude already. Like his his sparking came out just a few weeks ago, and they're like, oh, just recycle and make another extreme. Um, but that's not to say that he's not very good. Uh, I like this new generation of extreme units. That being alongside Broly, which I don't have, otherwise I would have showed him off because Broly's my favorite. But, you know, just looking at him stats-wise, it's not overwhelmingly high because it's it's an extreme unit. It's just going to be the way it is. But alongside that, we should know the fact that uh, low stats like this tend to tell us that there's an overwhelming amount of buffs for him, which he does have. And I find it a little odd that a unit that is strike-oriented has more blast attack than strike. I don't know what why they did that, but it is what it is. Um, arts, destroy two cards, major impact damage, that's pretty good. Restore key and do more damage by a green card. That's a very good green card. Now it's his abilities that are pretty, pretty crazy in my opinion. So main ability, he'll do 30, allies that are red or green will do 30% more damage, which is good because he's red. And the whole premise is to get, you know, uh, red, red, green units going because, you know, blue is going to counter your reds. You have a strong green unit. So they're really trying to push that whole meta. The whole idea uh, with Broly doing the same thing is just like this, where you have yellow, yellow, blue. Same idea here. Now, what I really like about the new generation of extremes is they have an incredibly overwhelmingly high Z ability right off the bat. Look at this, plus 25% dual buff to the element red. And then when your Z ability gets to three, he'll buff um, uh, green, I believe. It's, it's crazy how much they buff these, uh, these other types. Unique ability, so he's very good once you swap him in. 70% less damage, which is quite nice. And then he gives himself plus 30% strike damage inflicted, increased draw speed, for 30 timer counts that's pretty good that's an that's a quick buff for himself and then this hardwire hatred is what's pretty good as well so he hates goku so you're gonna do more damage against goku which makes sense and then for every other red green or purple you'll do 50 percent more damage and more key restore so i'm running him on a mono red for this one so he's off the back going to be getting 30 percent more damage inflicted and key recovery and if i happen to be facing a goku plus 20 percent more damage just off the bat really really quick so Main ability, reducing substitution count, is also pretty damn good. You can swap out real, real quick. Get your vanish back right away. That ability to get yourself out of danger is really underestimated. But anyways, that's enough talking about him. Enough about that. Let's jump to some PvP. So Alright, here we go, match number one, going up against a completely random team. Gonna start out with the Super Saiyan 3 Goku, just because of the reduced damage. I don't, now I don't, can't recall correctly if it's when he swaps in, or if it's just when your opponent does a combo, that he takes 70% less damage. I'll, I'll have to figure that out through practice here, assuming Satoshi <laughs> loads in. There we go. I wish I got this Android 13, or rather, I wish he was released sooner when I did my previous Mono Red team, but oh, I'm not gonna complain here. Get to do some additional damage. I'll hopefully pull some more copies and hopefully get a copy of that Extreme Broly. That's who I want the most. Uh, everyone got him, everyone's putting him to such good use. I, I wanna use him too, he's my favorite character, but feels like I'm never gonna get this guy. Always escapes me. Here we go, start out against the GT Goku. Now let's swap him in, let's see. Does it, is it reduce damage off the beginning? I don't think so. Oh yeah, it is, it's right there. All right, nice. Good old Pan, strong blue. I don't think he's gonna get chibated by that, he sees it's coming. There we go. What kind of damage can you do against the blue? It's actually not that bad. Uh, but I do have to keep in mind that he has a very strange team put together right now. Oh, I was a little late on that one. Ah, oh, that sucks. Oof. Take it. Oh, wow. That was that was quick. Ah, uh, let's go ahead and let Vegeta take the hit here. Um, I'm gonna go with the blue card. I haven't seen him throw one of those. Ah, there we go. Got that one guessed out. We're gonna go ahead and do some really good damage with the Vegeta here. Increase our draw speed, cause we want to keep this combo going. Hopefully we pull another card. There we go. Go with you, see what kind of damage you can do. Ooh, nice. 
Oh, I'm gonna get smacked by that. I took too long for that one. Ooh. Ooh, the crits. Ooh, how, how long is this combo gonna go for? I'm gonna swap out here. Distribute the damage evenly. See, this is the attack you should have had. You damn weenie. Oh, good old perfect vanishes. There we go. I cannot swap out to anyone else because Pan is going to get smacked by the Rising Rush, which would be problematic for me. So that's not what I want. That is fine. Hmm, not as fine, but that's okay. Woo! There we go, take care of Pan. This is what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna pop this, see what he's up to, lock him in. Now we should be good for... Oh, what? It wasn't quick enough? That's a shame. We'll swap in with the Vegeta, that's okay if we lose him. He can't get out of here. Substitution count is way too high. There we go. That's one of the nice little things you can do with him. Lock in your opponent. There we go. It only takes one decent blue unit to really take care of a mono red unit. A eh, mono red team, rather. It's very hard to make these things work. Gonna go with that. Gonna have to put a stop to that. And then we're going to go ahead and let him do some decent damage here. And then we'll finish out with the Android 13. Just because I want to see what kind of damage he can do to him. Uh, actually, we might be finishing it out with Super Saiyan 3 here. There we go. Alright, there we go. Match number one. Let's go quickly jump into match number two. Alright, here we go, match number two. You know, this is great. I haven't run into any bots so far. Uh, other content creators have been saying that they've been running into bots non-stop. Like, I feel bad for Goresh. He said he got to rank 50 just on bots. But, uh, looks like we're very lucky here. So what do we got? We got a full movie team. I love seeing these two Broly's being run, so that's, that's pretty awesome. Um, thankfully, he doesn't have any dangerous blues, but without a doubt, he's going to make his appearance. He, it would be foolish not to with him on a red team, so... Um... There are no Gokus that we can kill either, so we won't be getting that passive, which is a bit of a shame. So let's just do this. Yes, we're, we're going to war with war here. Let's have a good match. I can't wait in the hopes that I get that extreme Broly, because I, I just want to run him on a full Broly team. He's so good. He's so, so good. Damn, man. Awesome of them to make an a new Broly, at least. Uh, at least I'll give him that. But damn it, still didn't get him. Damn. We're gonna power up a bit, just get an idea of what he's up to. Yeah, 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 yeah. Get out of my face, boy. <laughs> All right, we're gonna power up. This is where this guy truly shines. If you can get priority, this guy does some gnarly damage. More damage up. He basically has. The uh, Red Gogeta's passive, if you ask me. That's basically what this is. Not sure what he's up to, but... Ah, curses. Alright, well, we're gonna take some hits here. That's okay. Good old Purple Broly, doing some really good damage. At least I think. Eh, not really. He's probably wait waiting on Blast Armor, so I'm probably gonna get hit here. Or not. That is completely fair. Ah, oh, damn. I didn't think you'd get vanished in that uh, quick enough. I don't mind taking some damage here with the guy. I just don't want to get Rise and Rush by him. Ah, oh, well done. Waiting on that right there. I just want to use the guy's main ability. Leave me alone. I got a green card for this one here. Good old Vegeta showing off his defensive capabilities. There we go. Just let me use the guy. Go away. Doing some really good damage. Alright, then we're just going to back up a little bit here. He's probably going to go in for a tackle. Uh, 
Wow, the timing. This happened yesterday as well. People get their timings for those things so down. I'm like, what the hell? That's very odd. Here we go. Gonna use the green card to power up and gain key. And then we're gonna go with the blue card. Woo! I wonder if that just killed this card. Oh, damn it. I thought I could have swapped out in time. I wonder if that killed this card. And he can't swap out despite using Vanish, so... What? Uh, what? What was that? I thought I had that. That's very odd. I thought I had that right there. That's okay. Uh, oh, he's going to use his ultimate. He sees me coming in. That's fine. As long as he doesn't get the faint, we should be okay. There we go. Ah, now he has no choice but to swap out to his blue. And, well, we got a Rising Rush ready for that guy. Come on, Vegeta, can you can you draw one more? And he can. Awesome. Well, we're gonna have to be careful, actually. He who who knows how he's gonna play this one out. He's gonna go ahead with one of those first. Nope. Took a little too long, friend. Going for the rising rush to finish this one out. Bit of a shame that we had our guy killed. That sucks. But I uh, guess he did some decent work. If we get if we get guessed here, we probably lost. Aha! There we go. It was a 50-50. I always hate it when it comes down to a rising rush like this, but it is what it is. All right, there we go. Let's jump into match number three. All right, here we go. Third and final match of video. Another movies team. Uh, kind of weird. Kind of a random assorted team here, but uh, he has two dangerous blues there. That doesn't look too good for us. So. This time I'm going to start out with 13. Uh, I want the guy to do more. I don't find myself using him too much, but I guess that's sort of, uh, I don't know, indicative of how impactful they feel when you use them on a team. I don't know. Like, he's a very good extreme and a good placeholder for, like, a mono team or whatever, but uh, I guess if you were to be using a mono team, you'd probably still have more viable options. Like, at AKA, this guy's probably very good for a bench. I don't really know. I guess i got to use him more. Let's see what we got here. He's probably going to start out with... Yeah, I would have thought it would be Vegeta, but that's okay. He probably has the exclamation mark. Curses. Alright, well, he does have his damage reduction. This is all fine and dandy. Probably going to swap out to that Vegeta next. Assuming this combo ends, but it's been like five years so far. 38 hit combo. Yikes. What's some really good buffs? That lady is crazy. Let's see what kind of damage this guy can do against the blue. So it doesn't look too, too bad. And the great part is we almost have our main ability as well. Give me this. There we go. Nice. Now I'm going to swap you out. After all, I don't want you to get killed. He's definitely going to rely on blast armor. I can already see it coming. Mm, I should really open those up with strike. Hey look, it's another version of you. I wonder how he feels about getting beaten up by himself. Probably very, very confusing. I'm bringing this guy back out. Thank you for bringing me a Goku to do 20% more damage on. Now you're going to stay in here with me. Ooh, this is perfect. Bye-bye. I know it's probably seen, it probably is a little reckless to be rising rushing um, a non-blue unit considering I'm all red, but I wanted to see. Well, it doesn't even matter. We didn't get it off. Uh, we're gonna swap into the Vegeta here just because he uh, his high defenses will help us out. Gonna have to do one of those. I find it odd how he's not going for, he's not bothering to swap out. I guess he's really trying to treasure those uh, blue units. That's odd. Ooh, that's even more strange. So I'm gonna bring him in. Gonna charge up with the green and finish you out with the blue. What? 
she lives. Aha, not in time. Oh crap, that's not good. That's not what we wanted at all. No, oh, no, 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 no. Don't do it, don't do it, Vegeta. Look, here, kill yourself instead. Aha. Damn, dude, you really don't like your old self. I wonder if we're gonna guess this right. Oh, curses. So this is gonna be an uphill battle. Vegeta is such a good blue unit, and we are stuck with just reds. So we'll see what happens. He probably has blast armor. Oh, if we get smacked by one of those. This is looking... Wow, we're doing like no damage. You know what we're gonna have to bank on? Getting a damn rising rush. Oh my goodness, could this have become... Could this have gone any better? Holy snikes. Please don't guess this. I, I, I hate it when my rising rushes get guessed. Woohoo! Wow, that couldn't have gotten any better to be honest. That was awesome. He's pretty good. Um, I don't know. I don't know what to say really. He, he's pretty good, but I mean if you're gonna run a... It, it's not really advised to run him on a red team. They still need to do more work to making those teams work. You know, like yellow, yellow, blue, red, red, green. They still got a lot to do before those become viable, but you can tell that that's the trend that they're going towards with these new units, especially with these overwhelming uh, Z abilities right out, right out of the bat. But if they really want to make it work, they have to have the dual Z abilities come out earlier. You can't lock them away with extremes at five stars. It's, it's hard enough to get one. How do you expect people to get them to five stars? But anyways, that's the third and final match of the video. Hope you guys enjoyed. And until next time, peace.